Hi everyone, Cranbox here in Taiab. Behind me you can see the police helicopter and the crew. They might be pre-flighting and they might be preparing to part soon. I don't know. We'll just keep an eye on them and see what they do. If they do, we'll get some nice helicopter departure footage. I believe that helicopter is called a Dolphin, Dolphin, European design I believe, and um, they're very big. It's used for rescue and police operations in Victoria. We're going to have a look around um, the Taiab airfield here as we are now and see what else we can spot while we're here. We're only here for a little while so um, won't see too much probably but it's a little bit interesting to visit a new aerodrome for the first time. Anyway let's keep looking around. And we'll just have another look around the airport and see what else we can find but there's a few interesting planes there I won't go into the actual airport terminal area um, we'll just have a look from the fence Does anyone know what to call that? Looks like a carbon, or oh, not a carbon. Looks like a Piper Cub, but it's not, is it? Or is it? Registration, Bravo Golf Lima. Put your comments below if you think you know what it is. Be interested to know. I'm not very good with aircraft identification, unfortunately. There's a couple more. That one over the far side is obviously a Cessna and the one in the foreground looks like a Piper. Cherokee maybe? It's a Cessna being prepared for flight, being refuelled at the moment. This one's being pre-flighted for circuit training. There's a nice little collection of planes here. So that's my visit to Taiab Airfield. Um, put your comment below. Who else likes visiting an air, airfield like this? Just something out of the blue and just checking it out and having a look around for a while, see what the activity is and seeing some of the planes being prepared for flight or helicopters, police helicopters being uh, warmed up, prepped for departure and flying away. It's pretty interesting stuff I reckon. I like it. It's a bit of fun isn't it? Aviation, it's in our blood for most of us that fly, 
well it must be if we are flying a lot of it started when we were kids the aerobats are relevant because when I was 16 I told a story some time ago on um, someone's uh, YouTube channel actually um, 17 I might have been and I rode to a, an airport uh, near where I lived actually it was like 30 kilometers away but still on a push bike and the guy asked me if I wanted to go for a fly in his plane turned out to be a Cessna Aerobat at the time this would be going back about 35 years and we did aerobatics loops rolls and a spin and I can tell you that was my first experience of aerobatics haven't forgotten it never will and whoever that was thank you very much for the offer that's what makes aviation and pilots these days great there's no holding back and it's just an experience that you have to dive into and enjoy if you're into aviation don't leave it too late get into it straight away don't wait just get into it anyway that's crayon box for another video just a short one oh maybe not depends how it edits i suppose something different though so that's another one for crayon box checking out the thai ab airport at the mornington peninsula in victoria um, just a fun look around an airfield that i've never been to before we'll see you in another video soon and uh, i'll keep them coming have a great happy new year by this time you've already seen i uh, had happy new year probably but i uh, have a great 2019 or 2019 as we sometimes say see you later bye thanks for watching this video if you haven't already or you are new to the channel like the video and hit the subscribe button to stay connected for future crayon box flying adventures